Welcome to the channel. Today, we're diving into a fascinating topic that's changing the way artificial intelligence understands the world, something called multimodal AI. Have you ever thought about how humans understand the world? When you visit a doctor, you describe your symptoms. But the doctor doesn't rely on words alone. They listen to your lungs, check your pulse, and look at your skin. Combining all of that helps them understand what's going on. Well, in the world of artificial intelligence, there's a similar concept. And it's called multimodal AI. Multimodal AI is a type of artificial intelligence that can take in, understand, and produce multiple types of data, not just text, but also images, audio, video, and more. These different data types are called modalities. Let's take Google's Gemini model as an example. It can understand voice, watch real-time video input, and respond with speech, music, code, images, you name it. Or look at ChatGPT4. Earlier versions could only handle text. But now, it understands text, images, and voice prompts. A big leap forward. Now, here's a quick side note. Some models work with two types of data, but aren't fully multimodal. For example, Sora from OpenAI turns text into video. MusicFX from Google turns text into music. But you can't feed video into Sora or audio into MusicFX. So those are called cross-modal models, not true multimodal ones. So why is this exciting? Because multimodal AI can combine information from multiple sources, just like a doctor uses different senses. Take self-driving cars. They use cameras, sensors, GPS, and audio to make better driving decisions. In healthcare, multimodal AI can analyze patient notes alongside x-rays or MRI scans. In fact, a 2022 study in Nature found that multimodal AI outperformed single-mode models when diagnosing chest conditions or predicting hospital stays. It also opens up entirely new possibilities. In education, a student could snap a photo of a math problem, ask a question by voice, and get a personalized explanation. In research, scientists could get summaries of complex documents as audio or video or combine data from different sources into a unified view. So how does it actually work? At the heart of it are embedding models. These convert different types of data, like text or images, into vectors that capture their meaning. This allows the AI to understand relationships. For example, it might learn that the word cat and a photo of a cat are close together in this vector space. In systems like ChatGPT, multiple models often work together. Say you speak a prompt. Your voice is turned into text, the AI interprets it, and then an image generation model creates a picture based on your request. What's next? Multimodal AI is still evolving fast. Just as we went from plain text to images and audio, the future could include even more modalities like 3D data, sensors, or real-time environments. There are still technical challenges, but the possibilities, they're huge. So that's a quick dive into the world of multimodal AI. By combining different types of data, these systems are becoming smarter, more helpful, and way more human-like. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, give it a like, drop your thoughts in the comments, and subscribe for more AI Explained, made simple. See you in the next one.